who checks in with a 1 0 record and a 1 4 2 ERA, one relief appearance, and one pretty solid start. Utley to left, and Michael Morse again. Tire record. Take Peacock the other way, no problem. The family loves it, and we're off to a good start again in Philly. It finally means something in September that there's guys on this team that know how to win now, and they know how to win in Philadelphia, a place where they haven't done it much. Morris wants the ball up. That's where he gets it. Strikeout number two, out number two here in the third. Fastball away. Rollins hits it well, but Ankiel's cruising. Three great innings. On one hit for Peacock in Philly. That's on top, 2 0. That pitch is up. Ibanez hacks it. Bernadina, he will grab it on the track heading into the scoreboard. Not a single ground ball out, and that's okay. Peacock through four. Good defense there. Curveball. How about 10 pitches per inning, ladies and gentlemen, for five innings for the rookie in his second major league start? Peacock brilliant on the one hit so far. Nats lead it 2 0. Didn't look at the runner that time, and he delivers a pitch that's popped up in the center. Hey, listen to you, partner. Rick and Keel right there. Roy Oswald's not going anywhere. Two down. Big pitch. Now all of a sudden, the wheels are starting to come off a little bit. You walked a couple of guys in a row. You get to a 3 2 count. You got to make a pitch, and you do. Big out. And no matter what, FP, it's still you and the hitter, right? Yep. And that's going to be it. Maybe Johnson doesn't want Peacock pitching to Chase Utley here. So the walk to Oswald really changed everything. Does Davy have the hook with him? He does. He wants the baseball. Five and two thirds for Peacock. One hit couple of walks other than that flawless this call to the bullpen packaged by the UPS store we love logistics Gorzolani gets the call Nats lead by two in the sixth.